Hello, my fair maiden. Welcome now to Thursday. Well, overcast and pensive is my prediction today for the virgins of the zodiac. The moon, which focuses our emotions, is now focusing yours on intellect. That means your emotions and your intellect are side by side. Now, the only danger in this transit is sometimes our emotions can trigger a mind game and mind games can trigger emotions, but that's the whole point, to unravel the big twisted knot of how emotions and, not, and mental can kind of co-trigger co each other. This is also the time where I usually recommend people to blog, to see their therapist, to talk to their best friend forever, to get things off your chest basically, because if you allow this kind of energy to intermingle, you'll find that you can crystallize how you feel more easily than usual and get that off your chest. So this is the time to really figure out exactly how you feel about something. Now zipping around in the sun in Gemini, Today the sun is ruled by Mercury. We're in chapter two and the topic this month for Virgos is your career and legacy. Now in chapter two, it's all about experimenting and when Gemini rules the day, it's all about talking. So today's a day to gather information, maybe work on your resume, maybe, maybe have a conversation with your boss about what it would take to be promoted. This is a day to seek out and get information and have important conversations. So if you've been waiting to talk to human resources, mm, Today's actually a good day. I recommend it. Also, Saturn. We haven't talked about Saturn in a while. Now, Saturn has been working on Virgos for the last 18 months, and boy, has it been difficult for you guys. You know, out of all the readings I actually have people buy from me, 90% of them are Virgos. Why? Because Saturn's in your sign. You are going through a major ego overhaul, and you are now in your last lap. And right now, Venus is working closely with Saturn, which means it's time to start creating the new Virgo 2.0. The new personality, the new ego, one that's less defensive, one that's more confident about relationships, one that honors yourself. So I recommend you go ahead and get that new haircut, you like mine, go get that new wardrobe, go do stuff new for the new ego and take advantage of this loving creation energy of Venus. Lastly, today we have a new episode with Skip Jennings at SoulGarden.tv on the mothership. Now Skip is kind of a spiritual philosopher. He gets super deep on our mind, our attitude, our prejudices, and how sometimes our own thoughts can betray us. And for you, this all applies to your career and legacy issues. So if you want to get a little deeper, he's about five to eight minutes an episode, I recommend our guy, Skip Jennings. All right, Fair Maiden, that's all I have for Thursday. I'll see you tomorrow with your weekend forecast. Live, love, be. So